Hello everyone, today we'll be looking at changing subjects or formulae. Topics covered in this lesson. Things to look out for. Example questions and exam questions. Things to look out for. Sometimes the questions may look hard but what you need to do is simple. Remove any powers or roots first, then do addition and multiplication, subtraction or divide last. However, it always depends on the formula that you're given. An example question. Make n the subject of m equals n squared plus 3. First, you subtract 3 from both sides. So you'll get n minus 3 equals to n squared. Next, you square root both sides to remove the n squared. And then you would get m minus 3. Well, the square root of m minus 3 equals to n which means that n equals plus or minus m minus 3. You put plus or minus because there are two possible answers because one of them could be positive and the other one could be negative. Now we're going to look at the first exam question. Make x the subject of y equals 2x plus 3 over 4. First, you multiply both sides by 4 to get 4y equal to 2x plus 3. Next, you subtract 3 from both sides to get 4y minus 3 equals to 2x. And then you divide both sides by 2 to get x equals 4y minus 3 over 2, which means that x equals 4y minus 3 over 2. Now we're going to look at the second exam question. Make b the subject of a equals the square root of b plus 2 over 5. First, you square both sides to get rid of the square root so it will become a squared equals to b plus 2 over 5. Next you multiply both sides by 5 to get 5a squared equals b plus 2. Then you subtract 2 from both sides to get 5a squared minus 2 equals b. This means that b equals to 5 a squared minus 2. I hope you found this video useful. Please click on the subscribe and bell buttons for more content from this channel and please feel free to share. Thank you for watching.